My name is Philip Ritzko, and I'm the Dean and Clinical Professor at the University of Connecticut School of Pharmacy. We are the number one school of pharmacy in all of New England. We have preeminent faculty and staff working in our facility, doing cutting edge research, both bench research in drug discovery, uh, drug formulations, toxicology, but also practice faculty. It provides phenomenal opportunities for our students to learn with these individuals and help guide them through their career choices. One of the priorities of our School of Pharmacy is to educate the future pharmacists of our profession. I feel that pharmacists are one of the most underutilized healthcare professionals, and it's important for us as a school to make sure that we keep abreast of the latest changes and advocate for students and the profession to make sure that we are a part of that healthcare system and allowing our future pharmacists and current pharmacists to practice at the top of their licenses and to provide the services that are badly needed within our healthcare settings and for our community. Our research faculty are currently working on drug development and drug design, also impacts of toxicology and pharmacology, in addition to drug discovery. There are collaborations with a number of researchers across our university, and it's gonna benefit all of us and it's great to just be a part of that whole process. The pandemic has exacerbated some of the supply chains and consequently we've had shortages. Some of our faculty are working on some cutting edge manufacturing techniques that will make manufacturing in the United States much more economical and easier other areas would be in reference to the health disparities that are within also our healthcare system. That is an area of focus that we would like to have in reference to practice guidelines and be a part of the changes relating to how pharmacists practice in our healthcare system and in the United States and in our state. The Yukon School of Pharmacy is important to the state of Connecticut because of our collaborations with a number of the agencies within our state to provide better services to our community. Our school got involved with the state right at the beginning of the pandemic. We developed a education training program and certification program to certify other healthcare providers and our faculty and students went across the state providing this service. We also had our students involved with contact tracing. In addition, one of our faculty members was on the governor's task force for COVID-19 vaccinations. Another example is there's been a lot of misinformation out there relating to the vaccine itself. And we actually developed YouTube videos specifically addressing questions relating to COVID and the vaccine. And they did it in five different languages. Student support is extremely important. It's a six-year program and uh, it can be very costly. We are always looking for ways to support our students, to reduce the stress on them, to allow them to focus on their academics and not to have to worry about financial constraints. Our alumni have a number of opportunities to engage with our school, depending on their passion, uh, they can help to support the research that our faculty are doing in specific areas. They can be mentors for our students and engage with our students in that respect, or be a part of our school and support many of our professionalism events that we have throughout the year. Working with such a talented group of faculty and staff, that's inspirational unto itself. It's the people. It's truly what makes UConn special.